Science 4, Quarter 1, Week 5 to Week 6 Milk Base Let's learn about Changes in Materials Hello kids! It's me, Teacher Frel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and hit the notification bell for the latest video. You can also follow my Facebook page, Teacher Frel TV. Welcome back kids! Our lesson for today in Science 4 is about changes in materials. At the end of this lesson, you are expected to Describe changes in the properties of materials when exposed to certain conditions such as temperature or when mixed with other materials. Try to sip some iced tea or cold water while you are going through all the learning tasks. What did you feel? Don't you know that cold water have more dissolved oxygen? That's why it feels better to sip cold drinks than a non-cold drinks. What happened to ice cube when they were exposed to heat? Correct! The ice cube melted. What made the ice cube melt? Let us study about the effect of temperature in the pace of materials. At constant pressure, the state of materials depend on the temperature by which they are exposed. The ice cube or the solid pace of water will melt if taken out of a freezer and stayed long at room temperature. The water that boils turns into gas or vapor that comes out of the kettle if left at high temperature for too long. What is temperature? Temperature is the measurement of the amount of the heat energy present in the surroundings. Temperature varies depending on the environment from where the materials are exposed. There is an exchange of heat between the substance and the surroundings. This means that heat can be absorbed by the materials or can be released by the materials. When the heat is absorbed by the materials, the temperature will increase, thus the material is hot. If heat is removed or released by the materials, temperature will decrease, thus it is cold. Another changes in materials due to the application of heat is called melting. Melting happens when solid materials changes into liquid form. Generally, an increase in the temperature turns solid into liquid or melting. Liquid to solid or freezing. Liquid into gases or evaporation. Solid into gas or sublimation. Boils water at certain point or boiling. When materials reach its melting point, solid materials change into liquid. The temperature at which the liquid will change back to solid is called freezing point. The melting point of ice is 0 degrees Celsius. This is also the freezing point of water. The boiling point or the temperature at which water boils and turn into gas is 100 degrees Celsius. If the change is from gas to liquid as the temperature falls below it, it is the condensation point. Combustion, also known as burning, is the basic chemical process of releasing energy from a fuel and air mixture. Let us study the changes in materials when mixed with other materials. Have you seen and taste halo-halo? Look at the picture of halo-halo. 
What are materials mixed to form a mixture of halo-halo? What is mixture? Mixture is a substance made by mixing other substances together. It is the product of the random distribution of the substance through another without any chemical reaction, as distinct for a compound. When two or more materials are combined or put together, a mixture is formed. Solid materials can be mixed or combined with other solid materials. Mixed materials can be classified depending on the appearance of the resulting mixture. There are types of mixture. When the solid material is mixed with other solid material, each of the mixed materials can be easily identified or distinguished from one another. These mixtures are called heterogeneous mixture. Examples of heterogeneous mixture are fruit salad, halo-halo, macaroni salad, burger, pizza, and many more. Some solid materials when mixed with other solid materials cannot be distinguished from each other. If the resulting mixture look the same throughout, this kind of mixture is called homogeneous mixture. Examples of homogeneous mixture are orange juice, coffee, vinegar, wine, and many more. And now, let's do learning task 1. Examine the picture below. Identify the process that caused the materials to change. Number 1. Candle What process that caused this material to change? Very good! The process is melting. Number 2. Ice drops What process that caused these materials to change? Very good! This process is melting. Number three, boiling water from the kettle. What process that caused these materials to change? Very good. This process is evaporation. Number four, water in an ice cube maker kept in the freezer. What process that caused these materials to change? Very good! This process is freezing. And number 5, mothballs placed in the clothes cabinet disappeared after one week exposure in the air. What process that caused these materials to change? Very good! This process is sublimation. Let's move to learning task 2. Write the change in the state of matter or materials in the pictures. Number 1. A candle, melting. What state of matter is melting? Very good! This is solid to liquid. Number 2. Ice drops melting. What state of material is melting? Very good! It is solid to liquid. Number 3. Boiling water, evaporation. What state of material is evaporation? Very good! Liquid to gas. Number 4. Ice cube maker kept in the freezer. Freezing. What state of matter is freezing? Very good! Liquid to solid. Number 5. Mothballs. Sublimation. What state of matter is this? Very good. Solid to gas. Learning task 3. Tell what type of mixtures are formed when these materials are mixed together. Number 1. Salt dissolved in water. What type of mixture is this? 
Very good! This is homogeneous mixture. Number two, mixed toys in the room. What type of mixture is this? Very good! This type of mixture is heterogeneous mixture. Number three, paper clips and pins. What type of mixture is this? Very good! This is heterogeneous mixture. Number four, soy sauce. What type of mixture is this? Very good! This mixture is homogeneous mixture. And number five, halo-halo. What type of mixture is this? Very good! This mixture is heterogeneous mixture. Learning task 4. Choose the letter of the best answer. Number 1. When a material was cooled, what happens to its temperature? A. Decrease B. Increase C. Disappear D. Remain the same What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter A. Decrease Number 2. Mark heated a chocolate bar to make a chocolate syrup. Which of the following describe the changes that happen in the property of the chocolate bar when it is heated? A. Shape B. Size C. A and B D. Size but not the shape What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter C. Shape and size. Number 3. What will happen to metals when heated? A. Expanded B. Frozen C. Contracted D. Melted What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter A. Expanded Number 4. When solid material is mixed with other solid material, the materials can be easily identified from one another. What type of mixture is formed? A. Homogeneous mixture B. Solid materials C. Heterogeneous mixture D. Mixed materials What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter C. Heterogeneous mixture and number 5, what do you call the type of mixture in which the resulting mixture look the same throughout? A. Homogeneous mixture B. Solid materials C. Heterogeneous mixture D. Mixed materials What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter A. Homogeneous mixture Remember! Temperature changes the state of materials. An increase in the temperature turns solid into liquid or melting, liquid to solid or freezing, liquid into gases or evaporation, solid into gas or sublimation, and boils water at certain point or boiling. A heterogeneous mixture is when solid materials are mixed with solid materials. Each of the mixed materials can be easily identified or distinguished from one another. A homogeneous mixture is when some solid materials when mixed with other materials cannot be distinguished from each other. So kids, are your all answers correct? Wow! Good job! Kids, I hope you learn a lot from this lesson. Until our next topic, bye-bye kids! Thanks for watching!